Hello, my name is Dr. Neufeld, and I do oculoplastic and cosmetic reconstructive surgery. I went to medical school uh, in Syracuse, uh, and then I did my residency at Cornell Hospital in New York, and then I did a fellowship at Duke Medical Center, uh, North Carolina. I've been practicing uh, oculoplastic surgery for about eight years now. I knew that I always wanted to be a doctor um, just because I knew that I wanted to play an active role in helping someone uh, either better themselves or get better. I do things ranging from repairing droopy eyelids, uh, facial trauma, fractures, lacerations, skin cancers around the eyelids and around the face, tumors that can happen around the eyes or even behind the eyes, as well as cosmetic uh, rejuvenation procedures that involve things like Botox or fillers or fat transplantation. I think it's important to make sure the patient understands uh, the process that they're about to undergo. Uh, I try and explain uh, the details of the surgery, uh, what they can expect ahead of time, and also at, more particularly after the surgery, uh, so that there's no surprises. I don't like any surprises during surgery, and I don't like the patient to have any surprises after the surgery. So I think it's important to really make sure that everyone's on the same page in terms of their expectations of what's going to happen, how it's going to be, and what's involved in the aftercare. Patients often express concerns to me about how they don't feel on the inside, how they look on the outside. What I strive for uh, and what most patients come back and report is that people tell them they look more rested, they look healthier, they look like they've been on a vacation. Uh, and to me, that's a sign of success because this is we've accomplished the goal of keeping the patient look natural, uh, look like themselves, just sort of a healthier uh, improved version of themselves. They feel more comfortable, uh, their eyes feel better, they don't bother them, uh, and I think it just overall improves their mood and their daily activities. Mm -hmm.